Imagine a tree so vast and powerful that its roots dig deep into the underworld, just like Tyron with your mama. Its trunk stands firmly on earth, and its branches reach up to the heavens. This is the world tree, a symbol of life, growth, and connection found in the myths of cultures all around the globe. From the icy lands of the Norse to the tropical jungles of the Maya, the world tree stands as a bridge between realms, a beacon of wisdom and strength. Today, we'll journey through time and space to explore this majestic symbol, uncovering its stories and secrets. In the cold, rugged lands of the Norse, where warriors and gods walked the earth, there stood a tree of immense power, Yggdrasil. This great ash tree connected the nine worlds, realms filled with gods, giants, and men. Yggdrasil's roots reached deep into the underworld, hell, while its branches extended to Asgard, the home of the mighty gods. This tree was more than just a bridge between worlds. It was the very fabric of existence, holding the cosmos together. The importance of Yggdrasil is highlighted by the tale of Odin, the Allfather. Seeking knowledge and wisdom, Odin hung himself from Yggdrasil's branches for nine long days and nights. Some would say he just found out that he just saw Tyrone visit Frigg. Through this ordeal, he gained the secrets of the runes, powerful symbols of magic and fate. Yggdrasil, therefore, was a source of profound wisdom and strength, a symbol of life, death, and rebirth in Norse mythology. Traveling now to the lush jungles of Mesoamerica, the Yaksha, or the Saba tree, revered by the Maya, this tree stood at the center of the world, connecting the heavens above, the earthly realm, and the underworld, Zibalba. The Yacha was not just a physical connection, but a spiritual one, linking gods and humans, life and death. Mayan kings were often depicted standing at the center of the Yaksha, embodying the role of the tree itself. They were seen as the bridge between the divine and the mortal, their authority and wisdom stemming from this sacred connection. The Tseba tree's deep roots and towering height made it a perfect symbol of stability and continuity, central to the Mayan understanding understanding of the universe and their place within it. Our journey now takes us to India, where another sacred tree stands, the Bodhi tree. This fig tree, under which Siddhartha Gautama meditated and attained enlightenment, is a powerful symbol in Buddhism. Located in Bodh Gaya, the Bodhi tree is a living testament to the Buddha's journey to awakening and the profound peace that comes with enlightenment. For Buddhists, the Bodhi tree is more than just a tree. It is a symbol of the potential for enlightenment within each of us. It represents the perseverance and dedication required to reach spiritual awakening. Under its branches, the Buddha found the ultimate truth, and thus, it serves as an eternal reminder of the power of meditation and the pursuit of inner peace. Crossing continents, we arrive in the Americas, where many Native American tribes also speak of a world tree. This tree stands as a symbol of the interconnectedness of all life. It appears in creation myths, where it often serves as the axis mundi, connecting the heavens and the earth, linking the physical world with the spiritual realm. For these cultures, the world tree represents harmony and balance in nature. It is a reminder of the sacred relationship between humans and the environment. In the arid deserts of ancient Egypt, the tree of life also holds a place of reverence. Known as the sycamore tree of Hathor, it was believed to provide sustenance and protection to the souls of the dead. This sacred tree was associated with Hathor, the goddess of love, beauty, and motherhood, who was often depicted as emerging from its branches to offer food and drink to the deceased. The tree of life in Egyptian mythology symbolized immortality and rebirth. It stood at the threshold of life and death, a beacon of hope and renewal for those who passed into the afterlife.